here we are at part 9 of my video walkthrough for Dragon Warrior 3. We are outside the village of Nave. Got a couple more levels that we need to grind up, and there is indeed one more item that we need to buy. I was incorrect before. Got a fight with three killer bees and a, one of these stupid army crabs. Alright, we are victorious. That is awesome. Alright, didn't get a level up that time, but uh, I did get the money to come in here and buy the last purchase, which is something I didn't realize I needed before. The iron shield there at the bottom. Be an upgrade for Cedric. Because Gwaylin, unfortunately, cannot use an Iron Shield. But it'll be alright. Alright. That kicks Cedric's defense up to 50. That is awesome. Now go sell off the stuff we don't need, and let's see if we can't get some levels, shall we? Back to the grind! Ooh, three army ants and a masked moth. This could turn out to be a bad fight. The uh, masked moth throws surround on everybody. But I think Bake can take care of it. Or, no, I had Quaylen take care of it. <laughs> awesome! Woo! Level up! Go Quaylen! Level 12. Strength goes up 1, Agility 1, Vitality 3, Luck 3, Intelligence 1, Maximum HP 7, and Maximum MP 4. Ooh, Quaylen gets a new spell. Of course, it's uh, been a while since I played this. I'm not sure which one is her new spell exactly, but it'll be alright. <laughs> alright, four killer bees! Finish this up. This area sucks. I'm ready to get out of here. Been grinding here for a while. Awesome. Woohoo! Cedric goes up to the next level. Agility 1, Vitality 4, Intelligence 1, Maximum HP 10. Got a thousand gold to boot. Alright, let's do our normal routine here. Let's head back to the castle and go talk to the king and uh, get our souls rest up, rested up and whatnot. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I had to yawn in the morning this time. Alright, back at the castle. Man, my dudes need to walk faster. Alright. Hero needs a couple thousand experience. Everyone else is slightly less than that. Trixie's about to go up. Now that we've uh, finished the nave area, let's move on to the next section of the game here, which will be the Noel's area, which is uh, located to the north. Which, uh,. Um, yeah. Here we are. It is Noel's. And everybody's asleep. The whole entire town is asleep. Well, that sounds like a good idea right now. <laughs> Except, of course, for one lonely old man up here in the corner. Mm, gotta return the dream ruby. Elves put a spell on the village. Alright. Hidden Grove to the west. Well, maybe we should go speak with these elves here and uh, see what they have to do. Just going around making sure everybody's asleep here. Give you your tour of the town. Even though there's not much town to be touring. And, uh, yep, 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 and, yep. That looks to be about it. Alright. 
over here to the west if you just follow the path until you come to the little dotted area there. This is the village of the elves. The elves are really pretty hateful people. They don't like humans at all. Your son eloped with an elven princess. Oh, tisk 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 tisk. No, won't sell anything to a human. You're gonna be kidnapped by humans. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Well, seems to me like we're gonna have to just go and get that dream ruby. That seems to be the gist of it, and it's located in the cave. Only thing is, that cave's really, really nasty and dangerous. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and grind myself up a level before I go in there. But, fortunately for you viewers, you get the short and sweet version of, of the, like, hour and a half, two hours that I had to spend grinding enemies to get a level up. Plus, you get to see some of the new enemies that are around in the area, such as gas crowds and Avenger Ravens. Awesome! Trixie goes up to the next level. Strength goes up 1, Agility 1, Vitality 6, Luck 3, Intelligence 1, Maximum HP 13, MP 4, and Trixie learns a new spell. Awesomeness. She learns... I don't know. Next fight, we have a Putrepup and a couple gas clouds. Chat Putrepups are old enemies for us. I think. Gas clouds and their blaze spells. Awesome! Baker goes up to the next level. Woohoo! Strength 3, Agility 6, Vitality 3, Luck 3, Intelligence 1, Maximum HP 8. Alright! Ooh, four Avenger Ravens. Now, one thing you gotta be warned on these guys is they have the ability to attack twice. They don't always use it, but they do have the ability to. So if all four of them attack twice, that's like eight attacks. That could get very dangerous for your party. Fortunately, they drop like flies. All right. Wayland goes up to the next level, 13. The infamous level 13. I wonder if she gets anything good. Ooh, got a new spell. Let's go see what it is here. Infernos. Awesome! She has her first main damage spell. Wind type magic. And the other dragon warriors, but in this one I don't think there's a wind type, so... It just is damage. Alright. Ooh, poison silkworms. Yeah, there's another one of those enemies you gotta watch out for in this area. They can, um, they have a poison breath attack, which has a chance of poisoning everybody in the party. I've had it happen before. It's very annoying to have to cast antidote four times after a fight. Consumes lots of MP. Very annoying. Ooh, go Trixie! You got to see the poison needle kill something. On a level up. Woohoo! Go Cedric! Strength 3, Agility 2, Vitality 3, Luck 3, Maximum HP 4, Cedric learns a new spell. Go Cedric. He learned Iron Eyes, which is a very interesting spell. Turns the entire party into iron and makes you impervious to attack for 3 or 4 rounds. But anyway, I'll see you all next time.